Hi, Water Signs. My name is Debbie, and I'm an intuitive reader, and I'm here today to give you guys your bonus readings for all the water signs out there. Hope you guys are doing well. Guys, don't forget to smash that like button, share, comment down below, as well as subscribe if you have not already. So we're going to get right into it here in regards to Scorpio. What does Scorpio need to know at this time? Somebody's going to practice, um, I hate to say this week, but I am feeling this week. Uh, somebody's going to practice to release the frustration of it all, ground their energy, and really start manifesting uh, their person back into their life again. They want to hear from them. They want that cup of love here. I do feel they make me zoom in on certain things. They're making me feel, here it is, that's Holy Spirit, and this reminds me of a uh, communion actually so i do feel that church related so i not to get in i don't really like going into uh religions because i feel that uh, i don't know uh but yeah so i literally feel that somebody actually goes to church and prays you know now we can also do this at home as well uh but definitely i feel that somebody um is really manifesting for this to take place you know you <laughs> I just heard power of prayer. So definitely somebody is either praying at home. I do feel it's a church, though. I do feel that. Now, that's not going to resonate for everyone. But I do feel that when you pray at church, whoever this is, you're manifesting with your thoughts here. It's coming true. Just keep on doing it, Scorpio, because somebody's rushing back to clear up the frustration, okay, that, you know, um, took place during this adventure here, you know, this journey. I do feel that it is a twin flame as well, but I do feel that just keep on doing it is your message. Try to stay balanced. Try to turn your back towards all the frustration over this because of the length of time and everything that took place and really, really pray here uh, for this to manifest. And it will. It's definitely helping. That's for sure. So... It's amazing what uh, spirit and universe is capable of. It really is. So, Cancer. Two of Swords. Ace of Pentacles. Uh, Seven of Pentacles. When they, when they have matching elements right next to each other, they make me add, subtract, what have you. This is adding. Uh, they, they're thinking about a new start, meaning putting in the work with the Eight of Pentacles added together here to make a decision. They're trying to think of a, of a solution, how to approach. Uh, they're more so in their head here. Uh, after they walked away from you with the Eight of Cups, they're returning. Could be dealing with a twin flame here as well. This is typical twin flame energy, absolutely. After they walk away, they're contemplating. You know, they could feel a little guilty here, but they you got they are really uh you are really on their mind here to start a new. It's coming, okay? It's definitely coming. There's a lot of regret coming in, I feel it, you know, but they're gonna make that decision to start over. Okay. Pisces, two of pentacles, ace of pentacles again, jeez, nice, okay, uh, so definitely I feel that your counterpart wants a new start, they're kind of deciding what to do here, but they're literally turned looking at that Ace of Pentacles. So they want a new start. Now, what's interesting about this spread is that they're still going to be a little quiet. They have been quiet in the past, but they really want to uh, uh, communicate and show the action. Could be dealing with Aries here, especially with that Page of Wands. But look what he's looking at. Five of Wands. So I feel that somebody out there who wants to communicate to you is kind of preparing mentally uh, for a slight argument here, okay? But in the same sense, oh, you got two aces. Oh, word to my mother. Uh, but definitely added together the five and the ace there. That's the six of wands. So they're willing to, you know, challenge. They're up. My favorite expression is, I'm always up for a good challenge. Now, I'm not a drama queen. I don't like drama. I kind of stay 
quiet, closed off. I don't really socialize unless it's karaoke night, then look out. Uh, but definitely I feel Pisces that, you know, somebody's kind of, yeah, I, I heard intimidated. Yeah, they're intimidated a little bit because they don't want to fight with you. They want success with you. So just keep that in mind when they return because they do feel a little paranoid. We'll put it that way. Okay. Uh, because they were wrong. They were quiet, you know, uh, but definitely I feel that they're up for the challenge to get you back and be successful. Nice. Very cute energy. And you did have two aces. So this is, could be a twin flame as well, especially with those two aces. That's 11 in the, in the world of divine. Uh, but definitely, you know, they want you back. So, but they are mentally preparing. <laughs> So that is what I have for whomever this is meant for. Thank you guys. I appreciate it. You guys rock. Have a good one and I'll talk to you soon.